When we started Uncommon Goods back in 1999, there was no Kickstarter, but it's really a natural fit between the two companies. Uh, our missions are really similar. We're focused on helping independent designers uh, and artists reach a broader audience. So Ward and Tokens and Icons have done a great job over the years, both with the quality of their product and also the innovation. They turn these objects from your favorite team into keepsakes you can use. I still have the Mets jacket I got back in 1969 when they won the World Series. The feeling goes way beyond the materials, whether it's a jacket or our new baseball beanie. My name is Ward Wallow, and I'm the founder of Tokens and Icons. Interesting enough, Uncommon Goods was kind of our Kickstarter. Um, over the years, they tried all our new products, and we really uh, feel complimented that they've chosen us for this new relationship where they're joining up with the Kickstarter community. At Tokens and Icons, we're approached by a lot of really interesting artifacts, and the challenge is how to incorporate them into everyday functionality. We make lots of products out of baseballs, and one day when we had it cut in half, the pill lifted out, and there was this yarn inside, so I asked one employee to painstakingly unwind it, and it was very obvious to me that there was a, there was a hat here. Amazingly enough, there was enough yarn in one ball to make a beanie hat. In trying to keep it special, we only use things that are off the field or game used. And that's the case here. These are the balls that when they go into the dirt and the catcher throws it off to the dugout, um, we have a relationship with Major League Baseball. These are fully authenticated. And the authenticator comes to our offices and witnesses it being made into a beating. When you go to MLB.com and type in the hologram number, it'll tell you the day of the game, who your favorite team was playing, and this verification kind of ties it all together.